Uh, we are going to start a tradition this year in honor of Jay Randolph Jr. Uh, we have named the award the Jay Randolph Jr. Good Guy Award. And here tonight to accept it is Jay's longtime girlfriend, Amy LaBelle. Fence, Doug. I am not going to lay a bunch of platitudes and things on you that people will say when someone dies. Because right now I am here to represent Jay, who was the weirdest. <laughs> Um, goofiest, most fun person I've ever met in my life. Yeah. And even though he didn't believe in the afterlife, I made him promise that he would stick around and watch everything that happens. So I am confident that he is here with us tonight. We love you, Jay! And he would be so overwhelmed by the outpouring of love and support and all of the messages that everybody sent the last few weeks. We read those to him and he really knew how much you enjoy what he did because he was the first person who would tell you he was not a radio broadcaster he was an entertainer and that's why it was okay for him to grope women's feet <laughs> and ask them questions about their most recent sexual experience <laughs> what position they were and of course he was a fan of documentaries, so there had to be a little bit of real history involved. <laughs> but Jay was the best, most entertaining person I will ever know. And he would be the first person to want you all to laugh and be happy tonight and celebrate this moment because he didn't believe in negativity, which he told me many times in the middle of arguments. <laughs> <laughs> and he's so proud of all of you for all of the things that you've done in his name. And I am so thankful for all the support and all the memories that people have shared because it really has helped family and friends quite a bit to read all of those things that you're writing and I am so glad, so glad that you've had an opportunity to do that and I'm so thankful in all of this pain and just shit, because I'm not going to lie, it's shit, that we have so many people who can tell us how much they love Jay and all the things he did that were so important to their lives. That's what helps us get up in the morning and move on through the day. So Tim and everyone else, thank you so much for all you've done to honor his memory and let's keep doing it for a long, long time because all he wanted was to be remembered. So thank you.